Okay, let's do this. Take two. Thankfully, I didn't get far on the recipe today. So, don't know what happened there, guys. Sorry. Uh, no idea why the mic didn't work and it's still actually not working the way it should. But I can see that it's coming through now. And thank you for the heads up. Got those of you who are on who are able to tell me that it was not working. So, thank you so much. Please, when you do get a second, there's about a 15 second delay between the chat box and what I'm saying, but when you do get, oh yes, I got it all good. I'm so pleased. I was gonna say there's a 15 second delay, so I've gotta wait 15 seconds before I know if you guys can hear. All right, pulled pork, 30 minutes. It's never been easier to make pulled meat in your Thermomix. It doesn't have to be pork, it could be chicken, beef. Uh, lamb can be a bit fatty, so it probably doesn't work as well, but so amazing, so easy, so quick. So let me show you how. I'm going to use this recipe here from the pulled pork brioche sliders with slaw. So this is um, cookie dough. It's the quick, it's the quick version. Okay, that's what I wanted. But I'm not going to make the slaw and the brioche. I'm just going to scroll down and I'm going to get this on to cook. So we scroll down, and I'm sorry you guys can't see. I haven't got my dual screens up at the moment. This is just from last night's cooking class. So I haven't. That's not why the mic wasn't working though. I don't know why that wasn't working. That was really weird. So let's come down and let's get started on the pulled pork. It's so simple. Anyone in the comment actually made pulled pork before? I'd love to know. So first things first is two cloves of garlic. Second thing is 100 grams of onions quartered. I've just halved mine and I've got a purple because that's what I've got more of at the moment. On with the lid. Oh, this is gonna make me cry. Anyway, that's okay. I can see confined space. Oh, can you hear it's done early? I've got the conf I haven't got the air conditioning on. Normally the air conditioning seems to offset the onion, but not a great idea to do cooking in a confined space, guys, with the door closed. Just a little FYI, community service announcement. There you go, look at that. Oh my gosh, so good. All right, now I'm going to get into this. 600 grams of sliced pork fillet. I'm trying to stay back, can you tell? I've just sliced it into kind of finger thickness, so maybe a little bit thicker. I'm quite generous usually. Do you guys like this chopping board from the mix shop? This is your chop to pot. Usually has a handle on it, but ours broke off a long time ago, both of ours. So uh, apparently they're not weighted to carry roast, roast um, meat on. They will break over time. Got 730, that'll do. Now we need some water, 500 grams. By the way, you don't have to use purple onion. You could use your brown onion. I think in the past we've used brown, but um, it's just what I've got an excess of at the moment. Still haven't hit the shops yet, even though restrictions are lifted now at lunchtime today, so that was pretty cool. All right, one tablespoon of smoked paprika. I think I've actually got sweet, but just use what you've got. Not sure that the kids would eat the smoked. Not sure. Okay, one tablespoon of sweetener. I'm just using my monk fruit sweetener. It does say brown sugar, but I'm gonna go with that. It says one tablespoon, I've only got a teaspoon in here, so we'll just do a heaped teaspoon as I drop it all over the place. Uh, one tablespoon of garlic powder. I've got flaked garlic instead. Interesting, there's a lot of garlic in it, isn't there? Two cloves of garlic and now a tablespoon of this. Oh, that onion guys is starting to get me. Okay, one teaspoon of fine salt. Might have to find that. Is it behind my cookbook? Yes, it is behind my cookbook. All right, one teaspoon of this. Oh, onion, onion eyes. And that's it, on with the lid. And this is gonna cook now for 30 minutes, 80 degrees, and it's slow stir. At the end, it asks us to add some barbecue sauce in, which I'm going to, um, we don't have barbecue sauce, so I'm just gonna actually Google what barbecue sauce is made up of and kind of just chuck those ingredients in and hope it works. And, uh, and it goes on reverse for a couple of seconds and it actually shreds and pulls your meat. So that's how simple it is to cook amazing food in your Thermomix. I love, Pamela, that you've, uh, you've had two of them. That is awesome. Uh, hello, Kelly. Lovely to have you on. Hey, Carissa. Thanks for popping by. All right. Well, I am going to love you and leave you. I'll be back a couple of times this afternoon to show you what else we're doing. There are a few more things on the menu. I've got some more fruit that needs still using up. 
So I'm going to get that sorted uh, into snacks for the kids. I've got a music guy recipe I want to show, with, um, show you guys as well. So we'll be back later. Reach out if I can help in any way with your demo mix. And if you'd like information about a demo, if you'd like information about purchasing, uh, those of you following along for a while, please remember to swing past my website and subscribe so that you can be first notified of a program I'm about to release to help inspire you to get more out of demo mix. So tmxingadventures.com.au, like BMXing, but with a T, okay? .com.au. 13, um, back in 2013, I thought that was a really good name. Now I'm forever explaining it to everybody. So <laughs> that's okay. TMXingadventures.com.au. All right, guys, have a fantastic afternoon. If I don't see you soon, I will see you. No, it's Easter weekend. I think, I don't know what I'm doing over the weekend yet. With the COVID lockdown that's just happened, I've, it's been kind of throwing everything into the air a bit. So. I will be back this afternoon, and I haven't yet sorted. Hopefully, in the next few hours, I'll sort out what the plan is for the weekend, whether I'm going to work or whether I'm going to sit back and enjoy it. Time will tell. Have a fantastic one, guys. Take care, and I'll see you soon. Bye.